Yeah, I'm Patrick Stone. I'm with the Technical Support Branch. I'm running 2020 Release 3 Update 9, version 10.09.0091. Um, I'm running version 4.3.7, released back in December of the CAD standards. Today is the 27th. What I want to talk to you today about is issues with annotations on cross sections. Give this just a second to regenerate. I want to show you what the problem is and how to fix it. What the problem is, is we're not getting a um, slope or an offset um, dimension on this cross section. And, and if you see this, what the problem is going to be, it's going to be in your annotation group. You have to be in the default view to fix this. And sometimes you have to close the Explorer down and open it back up or refresh it. So what we'll do is we'll hop in here and I'll, I'll show you what's going on. And this is for cross-section, so we're going to hop in the annotation group for cross-section in the drawing. Uh, and this will apply for all scales. We're just going to do the 10 scale and we'll fix it in the CAD standard so the next release be fixed. We're going to look at this full size one. That's what was um, annotate, used to annotate the cross sections. And you hit manage here. And, and what's going on here is, you know, we've got the cross section, the right slope annotation. Sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. There was a change in the code that Bentley made with this version that um, what it boils down to is you don't need this expression point one on top and two on top. They've put that in the code. Sometimes it causes problems. Sometimes it doesn't. In this particular case, this project was built in a previous version and then it was uh, re-annotated in this version. And funny enough, the right side of the road would work and the left side of the ro wo road would not. So first assumption was I thought it would be this uh, list of segments. You know, if you turn that on, it's got a list of segments down here. Although this is set not to um, use the segments. That's what I initially thought the problem was. But this will be the problem. So all you have to do is remove this, apply the expression, close it. And then I'm going to do that for the left side. Also, again, come up here to the location. Pick it once, it'll give you the little buttons to open this up. Point one and top and two on top. We're going to remove that. Once again, apply expressions. And it's going to be the same way. These were for the slopes, and these are for the dimension lines. So if you don't change these, you won't get your dimension lines. Okay, and they're all, sometimes they're in different order. See, this one's right here, point one, one on top and two on top. And you just remove it, apply it, close that, and we'll do the last one here. And we'll have to change these on all of the preferences. We'll try to get those changed before we can before we send them out next. And then what the next thing we'll do is we'll go in and verify that we made the changes. So it should have just been the left slope, right slope, and these are the dimensions for the left and the right. Let's close that down. We'll just wait on it. This is a pretty big file. Give it a few seconds to switch over. Maybe. Well, 
I'll give it a few more seconds. There it goes. Like I said, this has got a lot of cross sections in it. So we're just going to hop to one of these and I'll annotate one of them, try to speed this deal up. So what we'll have to do is remove the annotation and then re-annotate. Let's give this puppy a second to regenerate. So we got all of our graphics on here. You can see it's still missing. Um, we'll go here to draw on production or model annotation. We'll remove the model annotation. Uh, I would normally do this for all drawing models, but in, you know, just to speed this up, we're just going to do this one model. Still going to have to churn a little bit to do this. We'll let her churn out here. But just be on the lookout for it. If you see that you're missing a lane or a segment of any kind, this is probably the problem with this version. So that's the way to fix it. Um, we'll annotate it. And let's just annotate this this one model. We're using the 10 scale because that's the one we um, that's the one we just modified. Should churn here for a second too. Bear with me. It's a state computer. It's not cranking it out. And now we've got the offset and um, slope that we were missing before. So I hope this helps.